Good evening, one and all. We're here at the Akana. Interesting decision. The pitch really looks like there'll be something early for the bowlers, but the captain's asking the openers to get the pads on. Rabada coming in. Straight to the fielder. Needs a direct hit. A lot of pressure coming to the crease. Not had the best of weeks leading up to this game. So I want to show everyone their strength. Rabada over pitches and pays the price. Great shot by the batter. That could be four. Caress that nicely through the gap to the boundary. Getting nicely settled at the crease now. Would have to be very happy with that last shot. Lovely cover drive. Straight to the extra cover fielder. Misses. That's a big chance going begging. A lovely delivery, got it in short and surprised them. They'll be happy only one of those is allowed. Swept away but finds the fielder. End of the over, eight runs coming from it. The Super Giants are eight for none. Singh, the left arm medium bowler, is coming into the attack from the south end. Nice shot, but straight to gully. Misses everything. Drilled that one away. You can't hit the ball much better than that. Timed it to perfection. Darwin, I don't think, will be too happy with their bowler at the moment. Oh, bowler. What a beauty. Swung in and the stumps knocked over. An innings that promised much and really, in the end, delivered very little. Pretty disappointing all round. A difficult period as they come to the wicket. They'll take plenty of time to settle themselves in before facing their first ball. Head over the ball, great shot, that's racing away. You can't fault the bowling, sometimes your opponent is just too good. Wonderful front foot shot, and there was no point chasing that. End of the over, 10 off it. The Super Giants are 18 for one. They're off to a great start. Batters timing the ball well, and the bowlers look a little bit rattled. Too straight and punched through the leg side. Found the middle of the bat. Great timing. Lovely front foot shot. That has raced to the boundary. Tried something a bit different last delivery, and the captain shouldn't mind that too much. If they get it right, they just might get that wicket. Too good. That is huge. A fantastic shot off the back foot. Really well timed. Everyone just had to stand, watch and admire. The 
The shot's certainly being played at the moment. Some good batting mixed in with a little bit of good fortune. Two boundaries and two balls. Oh, <laughs> KL Rahul went long, high and hard. That is huge. Two in a row. Extra width gives him a free swing at the ball. Gone a long way back. Don't need to do anything special. Line and length is the key here. Bang, bolt, just stunning bowling. The trudge back to the pavilion. A disappointing display in the end. For someone with such batting skills, this goes down as a fail. Before that wicket, the new batter comes charging out to the crease. They're quick to take guard and face up. Great shot through the gap. Good pick up, big chance. Not the ideal way of handling that ball. End of the over, and what a beauty it was. Say what you want about the bowling, but you still have to hit them. Majestic batting. The right arm medium bowler is coming on to bowl from the south end. That is quite extraordinary. Huda, don't do it to them like that. What a shot. Hit that one on the up. A fabulous drive for six. Don't always mind getting hit for runs. What's important, just focus on getting the next delivery right. Can't get that outside the ring field. What a crucial breakthrough this is. Excellent bowling to get one of the key wickets cheaply. New batter comes to the crease. Never an easy time to come into bat after the fall of a wicket. And out. Two wickets. Two balls. There'd be a bit of tension in the batter's pavilion right now. They're on fire out there at the moment. A key batter gone for a duck, completely beaten. What a sight to see the stump sent flying. The hat-trick ball. This is the worst time to be coming out to the middle. Perfectly timed. Well, you can't fault that shot. It's nicely played, and it was four runs all the way. A uh, good contest here at the moment. Four off the last ball. It'll be interesting to see how the bowler can respond. End of the over. 12 runs coming from it. The Super Giants, 49 for four. Bra, the left arm orthodox bowler, is coming into the attack from the north end. Extra cover with a fantastic catch. The batter is kicking himself. And out. Oh, how did he get to that one? Well, this is a fantastic wicket. Kept the runs down, really didn't get settled, and looked to be in trouble for most of the knock. He's got their tail up. Finds the fielder with that shot. Chance. They go up here, but it might have pitched a bit short. I think we'll have to wait and see what the umpire says. Really getting to the tail enders now. Sick wicket gone. There's not a lot left in this lineup. And with that wicket, we'll see a change out in the middle. The task here will be that of support and getting themselves settled into their innings. Bishnoi ready to face their first ball. Really needs to settle quickly and see if they can get the ball into the gaps. Flex that one, simple as you like, inside the ring.
Lovely cover drive. It's straight to the extra cover fielder. Oh, that's a great shot early on. Wide of cover. And that'll give him a bit of confidence early on. May pull up short of the boundary, though. Pierced the gap wonderfully on the offside at cover. And that's the end of the innings. The Super Giants have set a target of 57 runs. I reckon this is a respectable total. If the bowlers can get firing and get some early wickets, this will be a difficult chase. Here we go. First ball. Big edge, where's that going? Yeah, it's so clear that all these spectators here today are completely enthralled and energised. Judging by that noise, anyway. Edge, but it drops safely. Let's just see if they can get that ball up into the slot as before. It's so crucial. You've got to follow up that last delivery and keep the batter under pressure. Some adjustments to the field. Head over the ball. Great shot. That's racing away. Erz on the side of bowling slightly fuller, and they've been put away. Can't afford to go too full again. It does help to switch up your deliveries, just to keep them guessing. Yeah, big opportunity. They've worked really hard in recent weeks. They should have the confidence to build an innings and get a big score on the board. Straight drive, mid-off will cut that one off. Beats the field with a great shot. Smashed all over the park. I wonder if the captain will stick with them. Doesn't even wait to see if the ball's going to do anything. Onto the front foot, punches it away to the boundary. Joseph, the right armour, is coming into the attack from the north end. Nicked it. Time to follow up after such a great delivery. Pitch it on a length is obviously the way to go. Perfectly timed. You just can't hit it any better than that. Beautiful shot. No chance at all for the fielders. Marvi over pitches and pays the price. Great shot by the batter. That could be four. That was a lovely flowing drive through the covers to pick up the four. Was quick onto that in the infield. Eight runs out of there. Punjab, 21 for none. Vishnoi into the attack now from the south end. Pulled away, but straight to square leg.
Caught, gone. Tried to go aerial, but straight to extra cover. The trudge back to the pavilion. A disappointing display in the end for someone with such batting skills. This one goes down as a fail. That's a long way to walk out there, just to turn around and walk straight back. They'll just want to get this first run behind them and then push on. That's a strong appeal. What's the umpire's decision? Yeah, the keeper's really gone up, as do the surrounding fielders. They seem convinced. Could be a review coming up. Was there a bat on it? Fielders think there was. This could be trouble. Now, I didn't pick up on anything there. Very close to the bat, though. Singh, looking quite surprised, didn't seem too worried about a reversal. Nicely fielded out deep on the boundary. Off the middle of the bat. That was a boundary the moment the ball left the bat. Can't time that any better. Perfection. That is a masterclass of batting. Reads the length, gets forward, and dispatches it to the boundary. Stoinis coming on, obviously hoping the pace will cause some trouble. Oh, wow. That is out of here. That could be out of the ground. Well, the bowler watches that one go straight back over their head for six. Brilliant shot. Can he come back with a dot ball? No point chasing that one. It is racing to the boundary. Just sheer power off the back foot. Don't need to worry about running. Jeez, time that well. There's the drive down the ground. Cracking stroke. Boundary last ball. What's to come this delivery? I wonder. Goes for it. Over cover and away it goes. Oh, all the way for six. That's all class. You're watching right there. Well, that's a waste of a delivery. Absolutely no trouble getting onto it and dispatching it for six. Gone. Catches, win matches, and that was a beauty. And out. Oh, how did he get to that one? As they head back to the pavilion, they'll be wishing they went about this innings a little differently. Not too much to speak of on the scoreboard. A nice glance off the pads. No stopping that one. That showed great skill. Lovely timing. The boundary was the only place that ball was heading. Oh, runs flowing freely in that over. 24 off it. Punjab, 53 for two. Four overs down, and the captain won't be too happy with their bowlers so far. It might just be time to mix things up a bit, maybe bring on a fourth or fifth change, just to try something different and hope their fortunes turn around. That's the end of our broadcast for now. Hope you enjoyed the match and join us again real soon.